I co-founded Serena and Lily in uh, 2003. I was chief creative officer and lead designer and my role as it shifted year by year by year with that growth just kind of pulled me away from the roots of my craft. I had so many ideas that had built up. They were simply patterns that excited me that I wanted to express. And I recognized that pattern work and textile design is really, it is an art form. And there's no reason that I should not see it as taking a valid place in my art studio. That is one of my primary art forms. The other primary art form are paintings on canvas and they're no better and no different from one another. It's simply that they are expressed through different ways. My paintings are really about composition and balance. Every painter's process is entirely different because they're driven by different things. They have different hang-ups. The goal should be that you create something that is satisfying. And that's, that's the only rule, I think. My process for a painting, when I sit down to ideate, I try different things. Um, sometimes it's more about pushing glaze layers, that I want something ethereal and kind of a, a, a strong color impact that has um, nuance and mystery where there's, there are no sections, it's just a fade of colors. Um, and that's what I feel like trying. It really just depends on my mood and my curiosity and the day. Typically, I would leave myself a week to complete a painting if I knew what I was doing. Some paintings have been in the works for months. I find that with full momentum and attention and giving it what it needs, it should be a few days. The most important part for me is that last 50%, maybe the last 40, 30% where I'm just tinkering. And most civilians would look at it and say, you were finished a long time ago, but I'm not satisfied until it sparks in some way and it's balancing correctly. And that's very personal. Knowing when a painting is done, that is gonna be different from artist to artist. It's not something that without training, people feel comfortable doing, but it's accessible to all of us. I anticipate that this is something that I will do for the rest of my life if I have the right platform that allows me to keep digging and expressing. And my goal is not being concerned with what people are buying, that I have to represent a herringbone because that's all the rage. I feel like my job is to pull people onto next. What's the next blue? What's the next herringbone? And I need to keep moving forward so that I can feel like I'm truly, authentically expressing what I have to say. Thank you.